So BRICS, what is BRICS? BRICS is an international because we have different uh, nations or different com countries as the members. Intergovernmental because different governments are uh, different national or different government of the countries are involved. Multilateral organization which has cooperation among different members or different countries in different fields okay so BRICS is an acronym which has five major emerging economies as its members and all the acronym all the letters of the acronym BRICS denote the name of one country each so B is Brazil R is Russia, I is India, C is China and S represents South Africa. So these are the mem uh, members of uh, BRICS. One important point. Okay, together BRICS countries represent over 3 billion people. Over 3 billion people or approx more than 40% of world's population. Around 42% uh, population it represents. Okay, so initially BRICS was not BRICS, it was BRIC, B-R-I-C. So Brazil, Russia, India and China were the four members and in 2010, South Africa also joined the groups. All BRICS members are G20 members also. This is another important point which can come as an MCQ. This is important for SSC banking as well as UPSC. The term BRIC was coined in 2001 by Jim O'Neill, the then chairman of Goldman Sachs Asset Management. So this is another important term. Now something about summits. This slide is very important, very short slide but very important. First summit was in Russia 2009. The next important question was the last held summit, ninth summit in 2017 which was held in Xiamen. China, it was the last summit and the upcoming summit, upcoming summit is in South Africa, Johannesburg in September 2018 as this image also represents Johannesburg, South Africa. Now there are two major uh, initiatives in the financial uh, terms or uh, in finance or in economy wise of the BRICS. The first and the major one is New Development Bank. It was formerly formerly referred to as the BRICS Development Bank. Now it is NDB. So it is a multilateral development bank formed by BRICS members, just like Asian Development Bank. Okay, Asian Development Bank was mainly developed by Southeast uh, Asian countries like Thailand, Malaysia, Indonesia, Philippines, Laos. Okay, so these were the members, Vietnam, many members all all the countries almost all the countries which are the members of ACN group now this one is developed by the BRICS members countries and the present headquarters are in Shanghai China the present president is Mr. KV Kamat he is from India the initial authorized capital of the bank is 100 billion dollars which is equally divided into 1 million shares. So 100 billion dollars is divided into 1 million shares. Now if you divide 100 billion by 1 million shares, you will find the value of one share. Okay. And all the members are equal, have equally uh, contributed to this 100 billion dollars. So 20 is to 20 is to 20 is to 20 is to 20 makes 100. Okay, so 1 is 2, 1 is 2, 1 is 2, 1 is 2, 1 to 20 percent partnership by each member. First regional office of New Development Bank is in is set up in Johannesburg, South Africa and NDB was proposed New Development Bank. This is important uh, point that NDB was proposed by India at the fourth BRICS summit in 2012 held in New Delhi. Please remember this point. We will also provide the PDF so you can uh, get all the points. Primary focus areas of lending, infrastructure and sustainable development projects. Okay, so these are the primary 
focus areas of lending infrastructure and sustainable development projects and another one is brics contingent reserve arrangement cra brics cra it is the arrangement for safeguarding against any short term global liquidity pressures okay so or for any short term balance of payment pressure this is just uh, like imf or international monetary fund so all the countries they have contributed some money they have some money reserve at this facility so that if any of the member country is facing some sort of pressure some sort of liquidity pressure some sort of uh, currency pressure so that it can take the money from uh, BRICS CRA contingent reserve management and can float so it was established in 2015 by BRICS country this is also very very important now question number 1 in which year did new development bank launch this first green bond and the correct answer is b 2016 this makes one important question and the second one is which country has highest share holding in new development bank this is sort of a tricky question because the correct answer is d uh, i have already discussed it that all countries have equal number of shares because all of have uh, all of them have 20% partnership each okay so all the other